Hi guys, it's Mrs. Lara. We're going to go over Little Red Caboose right now. And some of you know this song, some of you might not know it yet, and that's okay. So we'll teach it to you. Let's start with the words. So you'll repeat after me, okay? We're going to echo. Ready, set, me first. Little Red Caboose, your turn. Little Red Caboose. Little Red Caboose. Little Red Caboose. Little red caboose behind the train. Your turn. Little red caboose behind the train. My turn. Rolling down the tracks. Go. Rolling down the tracks. Me. Smokestacks on his back. You. Smokestacks on his back. Me. Little red caboose behind the train. Your turn. Little red caboose behind the train. All right. Have it so far? Here's what all the words sound like together with the melody. I'm going to play it for you and sing it for you. One, two, listen to me. Little red caboose, little red caboose, little red caboose behind the train. Rolling down the track, smokestacks on his back. Little red caboose behind the train. All right, this time sing it with me. Ready? One, two, ready, go. Little red caboose, little red caboose, little red caboose behind the train. Rolling down the track, smokestacks on his back. Little red caboose behind the train. Great job. Now there's another part that we can add to this. While somebody's singing the main melody, which you just learned, another person can sing the bass line. Here's how that would sound. Ready, set, listen first. Little red caboose, little red caboose, little red caboose behind the train. Rolling down the track, smokestacks on his back. Little red caboose behind the train. That bass line only used two different pitches. Can you hear when I changed pitch? What word did I change pitch on each time? Listen to it one more time. Little red caboose, little red caboose, little red caboose behind the train. Rolling down the tracks, smokestacks on his back. Little red caboose behind the train. Did you get it? Did you hear what word it was that I changed pitches on? If you guessed train, you're correct. Every time I said the word train, the note changed. And that's the same place the chords change in the song. The same place the notes change in the bass line that we just sang. Same place the chord changes in the song. So if you guys would like to play along with me, we're only going to use the first two strings. We know all four of our strings are good cows eat artichokes. But we're only going to use good and cows for this, okay? And we're going to start on cows, all right? So let's try it. We're going to pluck along, and every time we get to the word train, we're going to switch to the other string. So starting on cows. Ready, set, here we go. Little red caboose, little red caboose, little red caboose behind the train. Rolling down the track, smokestacks on his back. Little red caboose behind the train. Do you see every time we hit the word train, the string that I was using changed. You guys try it with me now. Ready, set, starting on C. Cows, 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 cows. Ready, switch to good, 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 good. Switch on back to cows, 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 cows. All right. 
right, we've got it so far. So remember, you have a couple of ways you could participate in Little Red Caboose right now. You can sing the main melody, which is the regular version of the song that we learned first. You can sing the bass line, which is what we practiced just before we were learning with the strings. Or you can pluck along on C and G, the way we just did. So here's an example of Mrs. Lara doing all of those things at once, and you can feel free to sing along and pluck along on your instruments. Wasn't that fun? You guys did such a great job. I can't wait to see you back here, uh, and I can't wait to sing and play along with you guys again soon. Bye! <laughs>